Oh my god guys, the new Christmas update is here. Reading the new the stuff. Present. Wow, so many gems. George are playing hide and seek. It is George's turn to hide. He must quickly find somewhere to hide before Pepper finishes counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> George has found somewhere to hide. Nine, just in time. Ten. Ready or not, here I come. Pepper has to find where George is hiding. Found you! Pepper has found George. George, I could see you too easily. Now it is Pepper's turn to hide. One, um, three. I'll help George to count. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, George, open your eyes. George has to find where Peppa is hiding. Oh. Peppa isn't hiding under the table. George, have you thought of looking upstairs? Pepper isn't under the bed. 
What was that strange noise? Pepper isn't behind the curtain. There is that strange noise again. What can it be? George has found where Pepper was hiding. George found me. Now it's Daddy's turn to hide. Oh, I think George should have another turn. But George isn't very good at hiding. I'm sure he'll be better this time. Close your eyes and start counting. One. Two. Oh three, dear. Pepper will easily four, find George. Five. George. Six, come over here. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Ready or not, here I come. Oh. George isn't hiding under the table. But George always hides under the table. Have you thought of looking upstairs? I know where he is. George is in the toy basket. Oh. George is not in the toy basket. Where can he be? Pepper cannot find George anywhere. Daddy, I can't find George anywhere. Oh dear, I wonder where he can be. <laughs> Actually, I think there's something about George in this newspaper. <laughs> George! Found you! <laughs> oh, George! That was a good place to hide! <laughs> George was hiding behind Daddy Pig's newspaper all the time! <laughs> Peppa Pig Peppa Pig Peppa Pig Guys, look, I found another present. Here's some Merbeast while away from keyboard hatch. I just bought this kind of jet. And now it's crashed. It takes on average 31 hours for a rescue team to find the survivors of a plane crash. And now me and the boys are literally stranded in the middle of nowhere until help arrives. Alright, let's assess the damage over here. I see some water bottles. We're getting thirsty out here, you know how it is. Oh look, they really paid two pilots and they only need one. That's why your flight's so expensive. Chris, what? I found snacks. So just like a normal plane, it's all terrible. We're saving these plane, we got racks. But if I'm hungry now, we're gonna pull the plane resources on the wing. This takes layovers to the next level. <laughs> the only food and water we have to survive is what's typically starved in a private jet. These tiny planes really don't have much food and water. I think it's time we use some strategy. Half of us should go explore the area, and the other half should keep organizing the inventory and building a shelter. Alright, let's all get red plane pieces. The longer we explore, the less we have to build. <laughs> we push it and we're making like a tent there. Uh -oh. It kind of works. I like it. That's what we want. So what is the objective of exploring? I don't think exploring does anything. Oh, let me put it that way. Does this not look like a movie scene? This feels like we're in Jurassic Park. It really does. Especially with that dinosaur. Oh, shoot. Wait, is this our new home? This is epic. And the progress over here. It looks like there's much water. I drink my four bottles. This is my share. You've been drinking water? I'm thirsty. What happened to ration? I rationed these nuts. Nice. Let's drink water because it's outdoor stuff. Come back so we take. Oh, it's scary in here now. Do you feel like you don't want to get back from here? I think we're lost. Uh, <laughs> guys, I got a fire pit. Holy crap. You ripped the engine off the plane. This is actually a perfect fire pit. You might not be the brightest, but this is impressive. I think I have enough window for the fireworks started. Look at that. Of course, it's big raining right now, dude. We are driving, not just surviving. You got an idea. Three. Give me the drone. Three brought the drone to get cool drone shot. But what he didn't plan for is for me to take the drone and use it to scout the area. Bro, it's literally just trees. What if one would do this? Yeah. This way. We may actually be lost. Carl! Great! Alright, still trees, still trees. Wait, what is that? Oh my god, the water. water. Look back up. That's a river. Still. Wait, where is this river? Is that Lemon? Is that Lemon? Hello? Okay, Carl, I'm having fun with the drone. You must say Lemon. Lemon just screamed. Where is he? Is he in the forest? Where are you? Lemon! Carl! Carl! Oh my god! Are you kidding? That's like nothing. Good that also wasn't even in the bag. <laughs> Watch yourself with that stick. What do you mean, Jimmy? Let me just lost him. And I find him in the bag of the one eat sticks. That's actually a lot of work. It's a quick last stick. You've been for an hour! Here's the situation. This plane we can fall at any point. We barely have any water left. And we haven't even built the helipad for the helicopter to land and kick us off with the time stuff yet. I know it's about to go bed, but I just remember we have a flare gun. No! Ow! Oh wow. Wait, is it gonna come down? Oh, we're dead. Oh, wait, never mind. Another one! Ooh. Before you shoot our last flare, what if we actually need a flare? Oh.
Sorry to interrupt, but let's continue. Thank <laughs> you. 